This is by no means Nicholas Owen's first time on Nine News. We introduced you to him back in the 90s when he was an ambassador for Children's Hospital. One of my favorites was Dikembe Mutombo. Back when a chance encounter during a hospital visit changed his trajectory. And at the time I was on forearm crutches and I looked up at Dikembe and I said, oh, can I walk between your legs? He goes, sure, go ahead. So I walked right between his legs. Dikembe was tall enough, Nick didn't have to duck. After that, I was like, this is amazing. At 13, the Nuggets offered a job. Pretty soon, that job turned into the kind of job fans dream about. And my boss said to me, Nick, we just want you in the locker room trying to inspire the guys to get moving. For 23 years, Nick has been the Nuggets' lucky charm. I'm in the locker room every night, just going around and giving them fist bumps. It is amazing. He's made tons of friends along the way. Nuggets of old, like Chauncey. He comes up to me. He's like, Nick, I miss you. And Mello, to the new squad. Especially Joker. He'll come up to me and he goes, Nick, my brother. Like Joker, my brother. Players don't seem to forget Nick because he's more than just an employee. They treat him so well. He's family. We had one game a few years ago where it was an 8.30 game and we had to leave early. And, and so we left. And then about 2 in the morning I get a text from Coach Malone saying, is Nicholas okay? And so that just speaks volumes in terms of family and caring for others. Even He didn't have to do that. Nobody does. And now he's ready for his family's next big milestone. I got so emotional. I mean, I was, I was crying because I was so happy. Ready for the biggest fist bumps of his life. I'm just trying to inspire the guys and just be in there uh, for support. And I'm just trying to, I don't know, be there. Nicholas is also a community ambassador for the Nuggets, meaning he goes to events across Colorado to represent the team. After our interview this afternoon, he was on his way to the Boys and Girls Club for a special NBA dedication there. He says that that Michael Malone story gets me every time I hear it. He says every time he goes down the tunnel, Michael Malone gives him a big bear hug. Everybody else does the fist bumps, and they're all excited to see him. They, he is a good luck charm. For well, he's team. seen a lot of different locker rooms then, winning teams, losing teams, no team that's ever won as much as this. This has to be a special locker room. This, he says that this is the most together he's seen a, a team in the locker room. There's yeah. something special about this team. He credits Coach Malone for a lot of that, but... Just, there's just a different vibe in the locker room right now. Uh, he may, so he told me that Chauncey back in 2009 promised in an ESPN interview that he was going to buy a ring for him if they won the championship. Oh. They didn't win, but so he might actually get his ring. Yeah, this may, time around. May come. This time around. It's and a, props to the Nuggets organization for seeing that he would be the perfect yeah. employee for them to yeah. hire. He's a great community ambassador for the team. I mean, it's hard to find somebody who loves this team more than he does. Very inspirational in a lot of ways. Steve, Thanks, we're Steve. the best stories. <laughs> we'll be Thank right you. back. You do.